What is happening, AIM Nation? This is N64 Josh, and I was at PAX yesterday. And I want to give a quick shout out to Damian Nash from DoD Uprising. Thanks so much, brother, for getting me the, the ticket. I really, really appreciate it. So the show floor was amazing. You got Capcom, you got PlayStation, you got Xbox. Here's some Halo 5, Super Mario Maker. There were DSs everywhere. Everybody was... Uh, it was just crazy. There was like these rooms with pillows and people were just like hanging out, playing DS, you know, whatever. PlayStation booth was awesome. Getting to see Uncharted looked beautiful. PlayStation also had the Star Wars Battlefront stuff, which I had to check out. Unfortunately, it was kind of hidden, so I didn't find it till later in the day. Didn't get a chance to uh, to get in line to play it because it was like literally hidden. There was it was a bummer, but I did stand and watch and talk to the, the rep for a little while and it's coming along very nicely. So if you are a Battlefront fan, you are in for a treat. I got to see some Horde mode and uh, just wave after wave of Stormtrooper. Looked awesome. Rainbow Six, I spent a little bit of time watching that. A little bit of PvE, a little bit of PvP. Looked great. The Division, unfortunately, I couldn't get my eyes on it because it was kind of hidden behind a curtain and the line was crazy to get into that thing. So still still you know still anticipating that guy i'm hoping for good things from the division it's looking good so you see dark souls 3 here again some halo 5 i did stand in line for probably an hour and a half the line kind of just formed around me i was just kind of spectating and all of a sudden the line moved and i was in it so i was like ah oh, cool i might as well just stay here and play so it was great i only uh only got to play for like maybe seven minutes after standing in line for an hour and a half because the team I was on, we absolutely just dominated the, the the red team. So got to get my hands on the Xbox Elite controller, which was super cool, very sturdy. Here's some uh, kind of some custom controllers that were just on display, looked very awesome. The show was amazing. The show was absolutely amazing. So if you have the chance to get to PAX, do whatever you can to get there because it is it's full of cool games, cool people, and uh, I, I can't I can't recommend it enough. I'm hoping to go for all all four days next year because I didn't have enough time to take everything in. It was it was that big, that crazy. So remember guys, check out amosisgaming.com. Make sure to uh, make sure to subscribe. We really appreciate it. And I leave you with this quick little message from Fallout 4. Um, steel chassis and you're not 